Law enforcement and emergency services risk their lives every day trying to keep us safe. Taryn Simmons is here for you tonight and shows us how Jackson County is preparing for any worst case scenario. SKU Task Force. That's the name of the group performing the public safety exercise held at the Optimistic Ice Arena this afternoon. Hunter Keith, a firefighter for the city of Jackson, says it takes a team working together to fight against an active threat. We can get really in there while the scene is unsecure and that extra layer of protection um, on top of our body armor that we go in really helps us um, get in there and solve the problem. Firefighters from the city of Jackson and Summit Township are taking part in the three-day training along with the Sheriff's Department and others. The three-day demonstration ends tomorrow. Kyle Rugi with Jackson County says today's exercise was designed to have firefighters team up with police to enter a building shortly after a shooting. Just to make sure that all local agencies in Jackson County are on the same page when it comes to an active assailant event. The exercise also invited students like Myla Shell and Maddie Stye from the Jackson Area Career Center to act as victims. And basically the first responders would come by and if they saw someone was dead, they would put the black tag and then leave them and try to get the people who were able to be saved. They say it's to make the experience more intense. I was a walking injured. Um, it's gone right now, but I had like gushing from my legs, so I was a hider. They had to try and find me and then guide me out. Shell and Stye hope to work in law enforcement in the future. Karen Simmons here for you in Jackson, 6 News.